let's verify the following trig identity. So we got one over sine squared theta. I'm gonna work the left and make it look like the right minus cosine squared theta, I'm converting cotangent squared into its basic components over sine squared theta. So if you notice here, they both share the common denominator sine squared, so I can convert this to one minus cosine squared theta over sine squared theta. So a trig identity, this is actually a trig identity here. So if you look at cosine squared theta plus sine squared theta equals one, we get, um, sine squared theta uh, is equal to one minus cosine squared theta. So we have sine squared theta over sine squared theta. And this equals one, which is equal to one. And that's it. That's how you prove it. All right. I hope that helped you out. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.